Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Bumblebee1009, and welcome to a game called Missing Hiker. I don't know what this game is about. Uh, haven't really looked at it too much, but here is the description of the game. Missing Hiker is a short indie horror game where your brother Ethan went missing while hiking, and you need to find him. There's not many reviews on this there's only a 703 very positive about 86 percent of the um, are positive so honestly let's just get right into this december 11th 1994 my brother ethan is missing for around 24 hours he went on a hiking trip near the red mountain he should have come home yesterday I went to the local police. They said they don't have the resources for a search right now. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. Okay. Oh, I'm driving myself. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. I love games like this where you can drive by yourself. I don't know how long this game is. Or if there's going to be need multiple parts, or if it's only a one-part game. No idea. No idea. You can't tell if we're almost out of gas or not. These are some very bad driving skills. Ooh, it's a house. Oh no, it's a gas station. I should park at this gas station to ask if they saw my brother. I'm trying to park perfectly, I don't know why. I don't see the use in it, but okay. I'm just dumb sometimes. We don't question it. It is dark. Oh, that's what that said. It said F for flashlight. Okay, so that's a rape van. Nobody's in this car. Nobody's in this car. There's my car. Just parked like absolutely fucking nothing. What do you want? I've been searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like this, especially in this area. What do you mean? Hey, look, man. I worked pretty late. I just want to grab some snacks and beers and drive home. I'm not in the mood to talk with people. I don't know. I understand. Sorry for, for bothering you. Annoying. It says achievement unlocked. Annoying. I'm not the one being annoying here. Oh, I can't walk over the counter. That's some gay shit. Can I pick up anything? No. What can I do for you, sir? You, I'm searching for my brother. He went, he was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look like? He has brown hair, it's pretty tall, and it's pretty tall. He also has a green backpack. Let me think for a second. 
I think I saw your brother. He came in here yesterday and bought a few things, some water and a few snacks. You're trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Yes, I did in fact, but they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. They said the only... They said they only start a search if a person is missing for more than 38, 48 hours. It isn't the first time someone met, went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I've heard rumors that there is a strange scream. There are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gas station leading to the mountain. Make sure to, st to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks. I'll sh make sure to stay safe. Take care. Oh, it's snowing. Just very lightly. Can I get into my car? Oh, no, I have to hike? I can't just drive this shit? Okay, well, what we're gonna do real quick is see how far we can just go down this road. And check the surrounding areas. Ooh, there's actual snow sounds. That's nice. I don't think I should go this way. Yep, it just stops me right here. Yep. Yeah, this is no walking. If I'm trying to be careful from wildlife and people, why wouldn't I just drive my car? My car would protect me from wildlife, meaning like probably deers, bears. Maybe not bears, but if you see it, you can drive away instead of running away, which they'll catch up to you. I just don't understand it. It's it's a bit weird. I, I also understand why in a small game like this, there's no voices. But it's kind of weird that there just isn't. I um my brother's tent looks entirely different. I should still take a closer look. Should you? Whoa, the fuck. That scared the fuck out of me. Whoa, whoa, who the fuck are you? You scared the shit out of me. I scared you. You almost, I almost had a heart attack myself. What do you want? I hope you're not some kind of pervert or creep. I'm not. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope, I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know how he looks like. Look, man, I'm just some guy that likes to hike... In in woods, in 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 a woods, and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You're planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes, I'll search around the area. I hope I can find my brother or at least traces uh, traces of him. Look, you'll probably think I'm a stoner or something, but last night my I had my tent a bit up north. And I had I heard no weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying, but I didn't see anything. It creeped it creeped me out. Maybe it was a cryptid. A what? Look, man, don't you carry? What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know, something for protection. You mean a gun? No, I don't. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. But I'm not going to stop you. I just want to sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up. 
a tent in the woods at night ever again. I almost would have shot you. Well, I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good luck with the search. Yep, that's one reason you don't do that shit. I haven't even been looking around much. Or talking. I've just realized that. But there's not much to this place. It's getting really cold. I should set up my tent on the left side of the road. What, like right here? Do I even have a tent? I didn't even know I had a tent. Where the fuck am I supposed to? Left side, do you mean right? What do you mean, set up your tent? Oh, there we are. This is why you don't go out walking around in snow, motherfucker. It's just a dumbass move. It's cold, but I'm falling asleep. Slowly. I think I heard someone scream. Not sure if that was real or imagined. I need to check. It could be my brother screaming for help. You ain't gotta check for shit. See the lights over there. I don't know if that's what he's talking about, though. I don't really want to have my lights on just in case there's someone here.
I don't think I should go this way. And what way should I go? There's no other lights anywhere. to go really I can't just go back Is that the light they're talking about? Hmm. Seems like a house. I wonder if there's multiple endings to this game. This game seems like an end, like a one of those games where it would be like something like Fears to Fathom, where there's the bad ending where you die, and then there's the good ending where you survive and like the either the police are called or some or you're safe now, you've escaped the situation, stuff like that. I kind of really don't like that there's not more, I guess. That's my brother's backpack. I must have been here. The backpack was completely empty. Nothing in here. Achievement unlocked. Backpack. There's no entrance. There's no break in the gate. Oh, there is. I'm just stupid. God. Can I take the cleaver for protection? What the hell? Someone made a picture of my tent? And my car? Blood all over the place. God damn, that scared the fuck out of me. Your body was never found again. Missing hiker. Damn. Is there more to it? I don't know if there is or if there isn't. Damn. 
if that was the if that was the end of it, that is a good ending to a starter game for a developer. A game like this, that's pretty good. But for now, I'm going to end this episode here. If you did like this video, please make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Go check out um, and support the creators of this game to see if they can create any bigger, better projects. But for now, going to end this episode here. I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye, guys.